Event number three, Little Frankenstein, sponsored by Morning Chalk Up. In this event, teams have eight minutes to complete 15, 12, 9, 9, 12, 15 thrusters and pull-ups. After that, they have five minutes to establish a one rep max deadlift. How this workout works, partner one will complete 15 thrusters, 15 pull-ups, 12 thrusters, 12 pull-ups, nine and nine. Then partner two will complete nine, 12, 15 of thrusters and pull-ups. If you fi finish before the eight minute time cap, then your t score is your time. If you don't quite make it, then your score for that component is your reps. For the deadlift, the deadlift does not start until the eight minute mark, and then both partners have five minutes combined to complete a deadlift max. Now let's go over the standards. Athletes cannot touch the bar until three, two, one, go. At that point, the athlete can take the bar from the floor. They can go immediately into a squat. We're looking for full depth on the thruster and a full lockout at the top. Pull-ups can be done strict butterfly or kipping as long as the athlete's chin passes the bar and the arms are fully extended after each rep. The scaled version of pull-ups for this competition will be jumping chest to bar pull-ups. Jumping chest bar pull up standards. The athlete will find a place where they have at least a hand's distance away from the bar. Athletes must reach full extension each rep and complete the rep by touching their chest to the bar each time. For the deadlift one rep max, all we're looking for is a complete lockout at the top. That means locked out in the hips, the knees, and the shoulders slightly behind the bar.